There's a, a famous book called Healing Back Pain, The Mind-Body Connection by John Sarno. And it says, heal without drugs, without surgery, without exercise, back pain can be stopped forever. And actually, John Sarno just died, I think, last year. This was a pretty revolutionary book when it came out because it was challenging the idea that back pain was due to a structural back issue. And I know I actually had success with this book in perhaps the mid, or, or I'm sorry, early 2000s when I had some generalized back pain before I knew anything about postural restoration. And I actually, it worked. And I've always wondered how I could have had success with this book and also with PRI. But then when you really start to understand what the author is saying, he's saying that the back pain is real. So don't get it misinterpreted that the pain isn't real. The back pain is real. What he's saying is that there is no structural issue in terms of there is nothing wrong with the person's back. And I think it's actually pretty well understood that that's kind of how it occurs these days. Uh, that just because someone has disc herniations doesn't necessarily mean that they are going to have uh, pain from those herniations unless they're pressing on a nerve. And he makes the point that behind this mind-body connection and back pain lies the autonomic nervous system. And that's also what postural restoration is saying, is this is all autonomic based. And if you don't, aren't familiar with the autonomic nervous system, it is the nervous system that takes care of all the behind the scenes work, right? You're not conscious of it, but it, it uh, regulates heart rate, breathing, digestion, basically all fun hormonal balance, all functions of your body that you don't have direct control over or conscious control over. And what he was saying was that the, reason, the physiological reason for the pain in muscles and back pain, and he also made this connection to other areas of the body, was lack of oxygen. And that when muscles, well, the autonomic nervous system is in charge of delivering oxygen to the muscles. So for some reason, the flow of oxygen gets cut off to muscles, and that's what causes pain, and that's, that's absolutely true. What Sarno was saying was that the pain was being used as a distraction from emotional feelings, such as anger, anxiety, and low self-esteem. Those were the three that he found to be the most prevalent among the patients that he was dealing with. And a lot of times, he's, in his point of view, that people weren't even aware of them. Uh, so it's not like it's necessarily something that you're completely aware of. He says it's actually in your subconscious. But the important thing was the cure. And this is what I found really, really fascinating. The cure was simply knowing that there was nothing structurally wrong with your back. And he found that when he told people this, if they accepted that, a lot of times the pain would just go away immediately or very, relatively quickly. And so he had people talking to themselves, basically saying, I know there's nothing wrong with my back, so the pain doesn't have to be there. And if they realized it was acting as a distraction for feelings that your brain would prefer not to deal with, once you realize that, that distraction is no longer needed because kind of the jig is up in a sense. And so it's that removal of ignorance in a sense that your brain is tricking you into think that, thinking that there's something physically wrong with you. The, again, the pain is real, but what he's saying is that there's nothing physically wrong with you in the sense that there's no structural damage that you should be afraid of. And a lot of times, the pain would go away. And I always had a hard time figuring that, or fitting that into what I know with postural restoration and how postural restoration works. But in reality, what you're doing is, again, it's all autonomic nervous system in the background tension. And in postural restoration and in this, you are breaking a pattern of some type. And when you break that pattern, in the Sarno book, if you, you're breaking the pattern of ignorance in the sense that you think there's something really structurally wrong with your back, 
And once you break that pattern of thinking, the anxiety drops away, the tension drops away, and the body relaxes. And perhaps that's why a lot of times the pain then you know, goes away. With postural restoration also, you're letting go of a pattern, but it's a pattern of movement that is ending up in pain. And at that point, your body is going from a parasympathetic state, I'm sorry, from a sympathetic state, which is over arousal and tension, to a parasympathetic state, which is a, a more of a state of relaxation. So, so there are two ways that you could go from a state of sympathetic overdrive and tension to a state, a more relaxed state, a parasympathetic state, and both this healing back pain and also postural restoration are doing the same thing, just slightly different ways. So maybe it is that some people just need to know mentally that there's really nothing wrong with their body and that results in a relaxation of the body and anxiety goes away and tension goes away. Or you get their body moving properly again and also now they know maybe it's just a muscular issue and it's nothing really that serious even though it does hurt. And so with postural restoration maybe it's working on both ends, the mental and the physical. The physical being you're stuck in a pattern of movement over on the right side and over, you're overusing your, the right side of your body and you can't get to the left properly so you can't alternate right to left. Uh, but either way, uh, it's a fascinating book. I highly recommend it. Again, it's Healing Back Pain, The Mind-Body Connection. That's it right there. And have a great day.